um, we talk about something called learning state. Now, learning state is where you allow all of your senses to pull in the information, not just your ears, uh, because ultimately everyone has a different representational system. And if you're highly visual, but you're supposed to take in information that is only auditory, like a podcast, you may miss a chunk of it because you're trying to listen through your ears that are not your preferred method of receival. So with the, with the learner's state, it's about being able to soften in your chair, not stare at the person that's presenting, but soften in your chair and let your peripheral vision go. So 180 degree vision where you can actually see your hands at the side of your head, soft gaze. Now, when you're at soft gaze, and this works really well for children in classrooms too, when you're doing soft gaze, it means that your heart rate has now dropped. You're not tunnel visioning with your, with your eyes. So whilst you might be staring at the teacher or you might be staring at me on the screen or whatever it is, if you let your gaze be soft and into peripheral vision, you'll actually be taking in more from your ears, from your kinesthetic, from your eyes, from the whole lot. And the information you retain is far higher a percentage than if you were just staring really hard at what at who was speaking to you so that's learner state really let your your softness happen where your peripheral vision is allowed to take over it means your ears will work better your eyes will work better and the feelings you connect to what's being said will also help glue it all together